So in this video, I'm going to show you how to add um, a new coin to your wallet. Let's say a new shit coin that you found in the market and you want to add it to your wallet. Maybe you're checking your wallet, you can't find it. And you're like, oh, I have to check. Oh, that coin, this coin, no, yeah, it's not here, it's not here. I can't find it, I can't find it. All right. And I'm going to show you how you can add that coin to your wallet with just contract ID, all right? So it's, it's not difficult. You know, most persons say, okay, I want to add this coin to my wallet. And that's those of y'all that know what contract ID is. Contract ID is that ID that is, is like a representation of the coin where you, it's, it's like that particular address that you can use to find the coin from anywhere, anywhere within the market, anywhere within a particular, um, you know, uh, you know, a website or coin or wherever the coins relies. All right. That's, you can use that uh, contract ID to find the coin. All right. So, you know, most person, you know, they have to go through their laptop to, you know, copy the right but I'm going to show you how to do that with your mobile phone. You can actually do everything with your mobile phone. You don't need a laptop. And I'm also going to show you how to get it on laptop, okay? So, with that said, all right, let's just do the video and then look at it. All right, so and now you are not subscribed to my channel. Make sure you subscribe. Hit the notification bell button so that whenever I upload a video next time, you will be able to see it first and you'll be able to take action first. And you'll be the first to, you know, Become rich with the idea I'm going to share with you. All right, let's see. All right, guys, you're welcome here. So for the purpose of this tutorial, I have to uh, install a new trust wallet on a new phone. So I'm going to create a new trust wallet for you guys so that you, uh, if you don't have one, you can as well do that by yourself. So if you have gotten to this point of this uh, tutorial, please do want to subscribe to my channel. Uh, make sure you click the notification bell button so that whenever I upload video, you can always be the first to you know see the video and then um, be able to utilize the opportunity that is there in. Okay, so let's begin. All right, so um, let me create a new trust wallet here. Please uh, don't take this serious. All right, so. Uh, okay uh going to repeat this all right this is this is just a new wallet so so mind you if you're out there okay this is just for the purpose of this tutorial this wallet i'm creating so if you are taking the, the recovery fresh series so that's your own point of uh that's that's for you all right so Remember this recovery phrase. You should copy it and save somewhere, or copy the URL, uh, this uh, QR code, and save somewhere. All right, not in your email. All right, you can print it and keep the QR code, or you can, you know, just write this write this recovery phrase and save somewhere. You can put it in a safe in a bank. You can put it in a in is your most private area safe. All right, but you shouldn't keep it in such a way that even you will have to lose. Uh, you have to miss it, all right? Because I've seen situations where most person tries to hide something and they hide it to the point that they themselves can no longer find what they they hid before. So, uh, if you lose control of this recovery phrase, not even trust wallet can recover your funds for you. So, be sure that you don't lose control of it. All right. So, uh, I've copied this down already. So, I have to hit continue. So, uh, trust wallet will require me to enter the recovery phrase in its order to be sure that I really copy things down well. Okay, the next one is try, then the next one is fiscal, fiscal, then the next one is badge, badge, then the next one is uh, square, square, all right, the next one is uh, pri private, and then the next one is uh, crater. Uh, then reflect, then fire, uh, and then what again? Uh, domain, uh, invalid order, then uh, domain exile, uh, scout. Oh, I miss something. I miss something, right? I miss something. All right, I miss. I miss a phrase. Okay, so I'm going to have to try this again. Okay, continue. It's, see, that's what happens when you miss a phrase. All right, so I'm going to 
start it all over again all right the first one is repeat uh, after repeat then we have um, try try then the next one is fiscal fiscal badge uh, square uh, private uh, creator that was what I missed before then reflect reflect then fire uh, domain uh, exile and then scout all right being the last one all right so we are done now so uh, it's all set up right now okay here we are we have our war right here okay now when you open your wallet you can see that there are limited coins you can just see Bitcoin Ethereum BNB and smart chain all right which is still BNB all right but uh, you notice that uh, and you have a whole lot of coins out there so this is where to add coin you go here click here now you can see here that there are a whole lot of coins that you can add you can even add a token here all right uh, you can even add a token but but you see that there are a whole lot of coins this is the place where you can add different coins let me say i want to ask stella right now all right so if you come back to your wallet you see that stella it has appeared down here all right so let me say i want to add another coin okay let me search uh okay we've added stella now let's say i want to add a coin that maybe scrolling here you can't find here now let's look for one rare coin that is not in the list here to add uh where do we find that let's go to our coin market where is that where is that i need to uh coin market cap coin okay it's like the app is in here so i'm going to go through the browser so coin market cap coin market cap all right so here we are we have some list of coins right here okay we have some list of coins right here a whole lot of coins so let me get a coin like uh save moon there's a coin called save moon right save moon save moon okay if your browser is faster enough it should be able to, to just come up all right but if you're okay you see it's a moon you see where well, there's another coin beside there all right okay let's add save moon now let's see how that is added okay let me type in save moon All right, you can see save moon is there so i can typically just add the save moon by clicking on that uh, toggle there and save moon will appear within my wallet all right but there are some situations where you want to add some coins some coins that are not in let, let's look for a typically new coin that are not here but you can't seem to find how to add them or where to add them from all right let's click on cryptocurrency here uh okay okay let me look for some rare coins like um a very new coin let's say hungry hungry beer all right let me look for this now let's go back here let's see if we can find that coin hungry i'm just using a random coin in the market okay hungry now you can see that hungry beer is not here now so long as the coin is on smart chain market that is on, on smart chain uh uh, ad address 
then there is always a way of you adding that coin here and that way is by going to the coin if you're using if you're using a coin cap market all right a coin market cap all right and uh, if you're using the app you might not be able to find this on the app so it will be advisable to just you are using the app to study that's fine and okay but it will be advisable for you to just switch to the browser and because it's on the browser like on, on your google chrome browser that you'll be able to find this so now we've searched this coin and here it is we have it here now you just scroll down here when you scroll down here i think i have to bring out my writing tool here now when you scroll down here you will see here's contract id the contract id here you can see smart chain all right now most times if you are using trust wallet you are you cannot add uh what is on ethereum network to uh, on what is on uh, a, a smart chain uh, wallet all right so now most times they will display beside here both smart chain and uh, they will see you will see beside like this drop down you are seeing here i mean this this uh, copy button you are seeing here you will see something like mod here like if you're using a desktop uh you will see ethereum and smart chain or most times if you see ethereum here instead of smart chain if you see ethereum network here ethereum chain here you will either see maybe in this other drop down here you will see smart chain which means that whatever you are going to add to your wallet is the smart chain uh, version all right so now what you just do is, is just to tap tap this button here and then to copy all right just tap that button there to copy so i'm just going to copy now you can see uh, a metamax id beside it all right that's typically telling you how to add it on metamax to as well so now that's what is that's the contra id with this contra id wherever the if you go to even the exchange pancake or anywhere that you want to exchange you can literally search out this coin from there all right so now I have to come here remember we searched it and we couldn't find it so here what we just need to do like most times what i literally do is i'll just go copy the contract id and paste it here you know because most times you might search name of a coin and two coins will appear okay you can see the coin the coin will pop up immediately and then you click that button and the coin is added all right so you can see it here we have it here so we've added the coin so that's how to add all the new or maybe any new shit coin that's on smart chain wallet to your uh um to your wallet address so that and into your uh, trust wallet so that's where to just you know go you know with this uh, contract id you can typically add any coin like you can typically search out any coin within a wallet and then be able to find them so long as it is on that chain so if your wallet is operating on a term chain so you might find it difficult to find you might not find it there or you will not find it there all right and uh, if you are using a contract id of um of of, of a, a term chain uh smart uh, a term chain on smart chain uh, uh so you might not be able to find that so you should be sure of whatever uh, uh chain that particular coin is operating on so i believe uh, you understand everything all right so if there is any confusion that you have please do what to subscribe below all right subscribe below uh i mean subscribe and then comment below uh if you have some idea to share or okay also share below if you don't understand anything share as well so thank you for watching the video see you in my next video more exploding content is coming your way so be sure you subscribe and stay tuned to the channel see you